Hi, and welcome to a very special issue of Climbing Daily. As it's some sort of social gathering going on behind me, they thought it was only appropriate that I present. Adam, you've got to finish it off. It's Charlie's leaving, do. <laughs> Charlie, what do you have to say to the legions of fans who are now going to be bereft of your daily presence? <laughs> That's quite a starter question for 10. Well, the assumption's got to be whoever takes over is going to be better than me. So it's got to be. Shouldn't only, be difficult. The only way is up, I think. So, my first memory of Charlie Bosco at Epic TV was a few years ago when he first started. and. Uh, he, just always, he was really good with the hands. He was very good at speaking with his hands. The web series he did for Epic TV called Talking Granite. Yes. And I remember him uh, struggling on a really easy boulder. Oh, I almost feel like one of those French rock climbers. And then a good one of these. Who, who is the best interview you ever had while at Climbing Daily? Probably the first one we did actually, Uli Steck at his house. Just to go to his house, it's quite a funky house. And you're kind of creepily into Uli Steck, aren't you? So it was a big day for you. Well, he's the same with me, to be honest. It's a bit of a mutual man crush. Um, but the house Beautiful. Is, the house is pretty unique, very minimal. I've never been in a proper minima, minima, minimalist house. Uli. Hey, Charlie. How are you Are you doing? good, you? An awesome office. Yeah, it's not too bad, yeah. eh? You wanna have a coffee and then we sit out, outside? It's coffee, Uli. It's very important to have good coffee. <laughs> that keeps your engine running, you know? Yeah, for sure. For sure. You take the machine to base camp? Yeah. Yeah, no, I always bring a mock in base oh, camp. Good man. <laughs> if I had to describe Charlie Bosco in one word, it would be, um... <clears throat> uh, Charlie, one word. Sarcastic which is nice. Bold, but not bold as in like heroic, bold as in like bolding. Charismatic, I'll give him that. Grafter, grafting. So generous. And what was the worst interview you ever did or presenter? I mean, it's nothing against her. She's a nice lady, but Akia Noguchi was difficult because I asked her if she spoke English. And she said yes, and it, that was sort of the limit of her English. And we were live on stage in, in Stuttgart. And that was tricky. It's my first winning for Adidas Rockstar and the without World Cups. I can't breathe. I'm too happy. My favourite Climbing Daily episode was the Andre and Magos La Sportiva edit. That was that was pure gold. He looked so uncomfortable. So problem at number two, Ginny Webb leading us off once again. Yanni with a different solution. So we're midway through problem two. Everyone apart from your neg got up the first problem. This one's looking a bit harder. The first four guys failed. Then Jan and Adam got it first time. And we got a big double fist pump off Adam. They're super friendly. They all get on well, but these guys want to win. My favourite climbing daily is when Charlie Bosco was at ISPO. He was testing out one of his lag boards and he was uh, hanging onto the board and he hung onto it and he got, you know, like top five, top three or something like that because he was one of the first eight people to do it. Then he turned to the camera and just went, beat that. Just seen this lag board. Now they've got a bit of a challenge, the hanging challenge, and the record was set by Ramon A. It's at two minutes, 44 seconds. I thought to finish the show, I'd have a quick go myself and it will be a quick go. Ready? <laughs> Thirtieth. Oh my God, if I beat you, you should be ashamed. <laughs> well, 
there you have it. What an amazing two years. Thank you uh, very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it and I'll probably see it at some climbing events in the future. Most of all, a big thanks to Hugo behind the camera and everybody at Epic. Cheers, everyone. There was loads more people here earlier, honestly. I had there were hundreds, hundreds, but they've gone or whatever. <laughs> <laughs>